dito sa Jordan River for baptism. abandon yan. And from 1967 hanggang sa 19, uh, hanggang 1994 ito ang area na ito ay hindi nabibisita. Kung meron mang pupunta nyo dito, may sport pa ng military. So tapos nagkaroon ng uh, ceasefire agreement between Jordan. Kasi yung kabilang side nila ay Jordan ha. Kaya nga mayroong flag doon hindi naman tatalo yung flag ng Jordan. <laughs> okay? Kunting-kunti na lang. Philippines na. <laughs> flag ng Jordan. So ayan ano. So nagkaroon naman ng agreement yung uh, Jordan at saka yung Israel. So naging ano to, itong nga uh, yun ito ay nagkaroon ng uh, peace uh, agreement dito sa area. So kaya nagkaroon na ng chance para manumbalik yung mga pilgrims. Sa area na ito, no wonder na kapag baptize na ulit dito sa area ng Israel and sa area naman ng Jordan ay merong baptism na rin na ginagawa. So both sides are baptismal side. Jordanian side and Israel side. Ngayon, uh, alam pa ninyo nag-spend ng around 2 Five, sabi rito um, Okay Masahin ko sa inyo ano uh, 2 Kings chapter 5 verse 1 to 14 Now Naaman Captain of the host of, of The king of Syria Was a great man with his master And honorable Because by him the Lord had given deliverance Unto Syria He was also a mighty man of valor But he was a leper Now we have a character In the Bible he is a Syrian general. Ang layo ng Syria nasa Upper Galilee. So, ang layo naman itong area na ito. Honorable person. And sabi dito, And the Syrians had gone out by companies and had thrown away captive out of the land of Israel, a little maid, and she waited on Ahmed's wife. And she said unto her mistress, Would God my Lord were with the prophet that is in Samaria? For he would recover him of his leprosy. So, meron daw prophet sa Samaria na kung pwede pagkaligin itong leprosy inaaman. Kasi noon mga kapatid, ang leprosy ay walang lunas. Kaya sa Bible, laging binabanggit yung mga tao may karamdaman na may leprosy. So, meron daw ang uh, prophet sa Samaria. Ang distance nun dito is around 60 kilometers. Okay? So, honorable warrior general, kaya lang ang problema may get, get Verse 4. And one went in and told his Lord, saying, Thus and thus said the maid that is on the land of Israel. And the king of Syria said, Go, go to, go, and I will send a letter unto the king of Israel. And he departed and took with him ten talents of silver and six thousand pieces of gold and ten uh, changes of raiment. So, pass forward na tayo. <laughs> Kikinis tayo pag ahon niyan. Tama. Alam ko po te. Ayan, Yeah, yeah brother. Ayan, <laughs> may ibang sa kabila. Baba. Say hi to your vlog. 
Oh, balik. Diyan kami ilunog-lo. Okay, bali isa-isa lang. Palalim dyan. Ano yung unay natin lalaki o babae? Ladies' Bahala choice. Ha? Bahala nga kung sila lang dyan. <laughs> Ate Bibi, ang kini-record mo na? Hindi pa. So, ayan. Uh, uh -oh. Sa nga pala, ano, yung baptism natin ginagawa ay immersion. Okay, lubog. <coughs> Kasi ang... Uh, ang... Uh, Greek word ng baptism ay baptizo, ang ibig sabihin yun ay to immerse o to submerge. Hindi wisik at hindi buhos kasi ang biblical baptism ay ilubog talaga. So it represents the burial and resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ. Alright? So ayan, may taga-picture naman tayo, no? Sino? Marami pa. Ah, marami. Ah, okay. Isa-isa lang tayo, ha? Ah, ko lang muna yung area. Hindi, babae, pinay. Hindi, ano Ibang lahi. Nakakot. Hindi, babae. Kasi ganyan siya. Hindi ganun, ganyan. Pihaya. naman talaga. Ang dito ng binte. May isda dyan, may isda. Ganun. Okay. Yeah. So, isa-isa lang mga kapatid. Si sino mauuna? Lapit lang dito, ha. Hanap lang dito. O oh, ingatin kasi malalim. Hindi, uh, picture lang 'yan, hindi picture. Tapos video. Wala ka mo 'yun. 'Yun video. Ay, ano? Oo, bawat lang. Pagkatapos natin mag-baptize lahat, mag-baptize tayo. Sa may picture lang. Diretso lang. Tapayin mo lang. O pwede nang bumaba pa ba 'yan? yung shade mo sis iiwanan mo may kasi lulubog ka Thank <laughs> I baptize you in the name of Father Amen. Amen. Praise God. Yay. I have decided.